Hey, London Westy, and it's uh, oh past too early in the morning. Uh, off to meet uh, CC Cash again. We're gonna do some first finds, hopefully, and we're gonna hide some caches for others to find. And right now, it's time to Cash Canada. Uh, met CC here at the uh, start of the uh, the trail. And I'm pretty sure we're not going to get the first to find, because somebody's already here. He and I have uh, met up with the culprit, and there he is, Stinger 503. <laughs> he got all the right? first to find! All the first yeah. to finds, except one? Yeah. One tree climb, and we're going to go get that right now? Yep. All right, how far is it? Uh, like 300 meters, maybe? 300 meters? Okay, you can walk. You're not getting on my back. <laughs> all right, let's go. Oh, I see it. Yeah, bison tube. Right up there. Okay, so I'll start climbing and then just direct me. Big clunky boots. Yep. That's a good thing. Thanks for Stinger for not wanting to go up in the tree in the yep. cold in the morning. I don't blame him. <laughs> you want to wait for CC to come along and get a tree climb for you. And the lonely cashier recedes down the path. And the intrepid ones go on. <laughs> Give CC just a moment. If she hasn't found it, I'll let her know. I'll give her a hint. I found this one last night with spring water, royal berries, and lyric glass as we were coming back from the gift festival. I'm here with uh, spring water, and we uh, finished the gift. And uh, on our way home, we saw there was a bunch of caches on the trail. Spring water didn't have her. Uh, first to find for the month yet so we came and got it in a prickly tree rain off and on but we got the cash and uh, we're on our way home come here spring water say hi thanks for the FTF alrighty alright thanks for watching catch us again gotta get in it's too wet I see it hey she got her Woo. didn't take her too long that was only what a half an hour <laughs> Right. <laughs> Maybe a half a minute. No, took her about two minutes and eh, she got it. It was pretty easy. But I tell you, it was harder in the dark and the rain. No real humans. Oh, here it is, right here. Oh. Oh. Super easy. <laughs> <laughs> what? A mouse? <laughs> We're just watching that last <laughs> shot ourselves. I'm so glad I had the camera running. Oh, it was so funny. Oh but there is a little, uh, mouse a little mousy house in there. <laughs> and I'm glad I'm not the one that squealed because I don't, I just can't live down my mice hides <laughs> or my mice mice fine. <laughs> my mice finds. There. <laughs> <Off your leg. laughs> uh, oh. Onward I go. Here we go, another cash. Got it already. Ah. All the places we looked and all the other ones and no, wouldn't be there. Bison tube. Yeah, awesome. Green bison tube. <laughs> next cache that we're looking for was been, has been here for quite a while uh, but not a long time because it should be right there CC found this about two years ago and uh, we're gonna put this uh, cache location on watch list because uh, we have an idea for a, a very evil hide we're just gonna wait it'll get archived soon and stay tuned folks <laughs> uh, first spot we've come up to is uh, this old bridge. We're gonna take a look at where to uh, place a cache here. And uh, we got a few ideas. We're gonna check it out. Cause there's, uh, there's a top and there's a bottom. Bottom to your top and a top to your bottom. And I think we, uh, we know where we're gonna put this. And uh, you gotta come find it. <laughs> Around these parts, Everybody likes a tree climb cache. 
So you can just about guess where this one's gonna go. Whew, alrighty. I've had this one in my bag for a long time to hide. And I always wanted to call it Big Blue. I don't know if it's what we're gonna call it, but here you go. We'll pass that up to CC. Here you go. You got it? Yeah. All right. CC is just above me in the tree. And we're about, oh, I don't know. Wait a ways. Woo, windy. It's windy. Uh-oh, hold on. Hold on. Wind is kicking up. Okay, maybe I'll Now would be the time you drop the phone. I don't know if you can see down. It's quite a ways. Yikes. There, we're looking down. I don't know how many feet we're up. Maybe 50, 60 feet, what do you think? Yeah, about that. Maybe more, I don't know. It's uh... Oh, where did your GPS elevation say? <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll check that. Oh, I left my GPS down below. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. We'll get this on. We'll get back down before I fall down. He's got the, uh, the cache in place. If you can see it right there. And it's not hard to find. You just got to come up and get it. That's all. Shall we get down now? Yes, the wind Please. is coming again. <laughs> CC is making her way down. I have wanted to place that bison tube for quite a while. I bought that bison tube at the Space Coast Geocacher store in Florida, or West Coast, East Coast, in Florida back in 2015, more than two and a half years ago. And I've just been waiting for the right tree to come along. And here it is. See, he's coming back to ground. And we'll see if we can find another spot for a cache. Yay! Good one! Whoa! <laughs> now we're going to find one that I haven't been able to find. CC is going to help me with it. And uh, then we'll go back up and hide some more. Hi. How you doing? Muggle. Found it. Yay! <laughs> Yay! It's right there. It's over there. It's there. <laughs> there you go. This cache hasn't been found for a, a year and a half. I think I might have been here twice to uh, to see this one. It's called uh, Boxcar Willie, and it was in that wire tie underneath. And if you like rail cars and trains and such, you'll like this spot because there's a rail line on either side of you. There's one, uh, one below me here, and then, uh, of course, the rail line over here has uh, some activity on it. It's a classic cache. Bison tube up underneath the rail tie. So uh, if you know the area and you're still looking for this one, come and get it. Nice to finally get that cache done. I've wanted that one for a while. We were close by, so we came to get it. And uh, we're going to go and hide a few more caches. And uh, somebody placed the cache right up that tree. I wonder who it could be that placed it in the tree. <laughs> Come on, let's catch on. So this is the end of our little adventure. We want to uh, say, uh, say thank you to uh, Squeaky348 for doing all the caches she did on the Trans Canada Trail. And uh, we just finished placing how many? Four, five. five. Five caches here on the Tilsonburg Recreational Trail. So this is the end of this video, but the beginning of your adventure because you need to start searching here and go that way. Alrighty, so thanks for watching. Did you have a good time, CC? I had a blast like usual. I'm going to have to start paying you royalties because you're in a lot of these videos. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. People are going to get the wrong idea. Lear class is working. I work later. So uh, thanks for watching. Sign up to watch more Cash Canada.
Take care. See ya.